Bobby Johnson. I'm Amy, and it's time for your weekly cooking show, Lunchy Monday, produced by At Home with TJ TV. In today's show, we'll be showing you how to make dumplings, chicken adobo, rice, mud cake, and carrot cake. First, let's go to Sam and see how he makes his dumplings. Hello, this is Sam, and today we're going to learn how to make Chinese dumplings. It's really easy and really delicious. And now let's see how we do it. First, start with materials. We have some meat. Uh, it can be any meat you want, and spring onion and carrots and other stuff using for flavor. Now we cut the spring onion. If you don't want dumplings, maybe you want some chicken adobo. So let's go to Isabella for that. Thank you, Isabella, for that tutorial. If you want some rice with your chicken adobo, let's watch the tutorial by Reese. In this video, I will be showing you how to cook rice in a pot. First, you're going to measure out how much rice you want. I use two cups. Now, you're going to clean your rice just like this. Repeat this process until the water is clear. Now you're going to add water up to the first line on your index finger. Put that on the stove on a high heat with the lid. As soon as the water boils, turn the heat down to low and set a timer for 20 minutes. Once the timer is done, turn off the heat. Now, fluff your rice like so. When you're done, it should look like this. Thanks, Reese. If you want a dessert with all that amazing food, let's watch my tutorial on how to make mud cake. What you're going to need is oil, milk, sugar, all-purpose flour, 
cocoa powder, vanilla extract, baking powder, salt, and frosting. This frosting is optional. First, put three tablespoons of flour, then three tablespoons of sugar, then one four teaspoons of baking powder, then a pinch of salt, and then mix it up till it looks like a light brown powder. Then you're gonna put half of a teaspoon of vanilla extract, three and a half tablespoons of milk, and two tablespoons of oil. Mix it up till it looks liquidy just like this. Then put it in the microwave for one minute. You may need to put more, so if you do, just put 30 seconds extra. I needed more, so I put 30 seconds. Then take a knife and put it in the middle of the cake, and if it comes out clean, then you're ready to go. If you want to put frosting, make sure to make a bowl of the mug cake and put frosting inside the mug cake and make sure it goes from top to bottom. So I got it. Then take more frosting and cover the whole top layer. So it should look something like this. And then you're ready to eat. I hope you enjoyed and how to make this mug cake. If you want to make something without chocolate, then let's watch Polly's tutorial on how to make carrot cake. That's all we have for today's Monday Monday. Join us next Monday for some more awesome recipes.